Hey, how's everybody doing? It's Gord again with a new video after a while. This is a really nice low fat pipe. I bought it from uh, Pipe Smoker Wales or Smoky Dan who recently gave up the uh, the pipe smoking hobby at least that's what I understood from him. It's really a pity because uh, I think he's a great guy. He made some really nice videos. He really has a talent for, for visual, you know, for, for a way of displaying things. I mean, my videos are, aren't are edited. At least my pipe smoking videos are not. Uh, I just put down a camera, pack a pipe, and then start smoking and start talking about the hobby, you know, and, and Dan really made some, I, it, for me it was almost art, the way he edited his videos. Really nice lighting and, and you know, the, the way the, the effects were used, really nice. So I hope that Dan will continue to make videos. Um, so, I bought this nice little low vet off of him. It looks a lot like the, the first pipe that I ever actually... Well, they're not identical. This is Stanwall pipe. This is a Big Ben pipe. This is the first. The Big Ben is the first pipe that I had, I ever had, and I really like the the Lovat shape. It, it for me and smoking by tobacco. It's really perfect. This is Friese, echte Friese hereby. It's a Dutch tobacco. Just for the thumbnail that. Uh, <laughs> It's a Dutch by tobacco, which means it's it's quite dry, quite cigarette. I, I'm not sure if you can see. It's a uh, Virginia. Well, let me see if it describes on the package what's in there. Da -da 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 -da. No. It's um. Well, I I it, uh, a bit cigarette like maybe you can inhale it if you're careful. Up, you know, some people don't inhale, some people do. Everybody should find out for themselves if, if that's something that they want. I don't always, but on some occasions I just... I do it, I don't know why. It's a habit, I used to be a cigarette smoker. But, okay. As you uh, might have noticed if you're a subscriber, I recently started uploading some video game material. Um, my channel is not only dedicated to pipe smoking. It's uh, it's basically my channel, so I I upload what what I'm interested in. And one of my biggest hobbies is is of course pipe smoking. But apart from that, I I have some toys. I like uh, flying with drones, I like uh, driving my RC car at the beach. Actually, I'm not sure if I showed you guys what the fast attack vehicle turned out to be. Just let me show it real quick. Anyway, that's it. It's very dirty with, with sand because I, I, I use it at the beach. It's really a great buggy, great time. Anyway, so that's I, I want to upload some, some RC car driving, some drone flying, and of course some video games. I've been playing uh, Ace Combat uh, 6 on Xbox. And, you know, uh, I can understand. I'm losing some, some of my... my pipe smoking uh, subscribers and I, I fully understand that I mean the YTPC is a community where a lot of people are making videos dedicated purely 100% to pipe smoking maybe I'm, I'm just a bit different there I'm sorry to see some of the subscribers go but I, I fully understand on the other hand I, I'm Recently getting new subscribers because of the, the Ace Combat videos. So especially to you guys, the new subscribers, welcome to my channel. Really 
happy to see uh, some people that are interested in it in my videos. I'll be uploading a rant also this weekend. My my wife and daughter are out on holiday, so I I have some I can smoke inside. I don't spend a lot of time in the in the shed round nowadays. So I will be uploading another video about the um, flight sims on Xbox. My previous video had quite some attention and I want to make a follow up on that. Apart from that, so tobacco related, we uh, have something new here in the Netherlands. Um, I'm not sure how that is in the United States. I don't know if, if manufacturers of tobacco are obliged to put a warning on tobacco. So for instance, if I take this, this package, um, it used to be uh, mandatory for, uh, for manufacturers to put smoking is deadly and smoking causes heart diseases, blah, blah, blah. You know, these kind of warnings on the packages. They have been around for, I would say, 20 years or something, those warnings. And now there is a new law where every tobacco package needs to have at least 60% covered with warning and also with, with some some really horror pictures, you know. I, I recently bought a uh, Fort Trekker, my, my daily tobacco. I bought one of the new pouches which has a woman coughing in a in a blanket and the blanket was covered in blood it was really really disgusting and my daughter was was seeing that picture and she was like dad what you know why are they putting these kind of pictures on that and i tried to explain to her that smoking is is, is well she knows that smoking is, is not the best thing you could do for your own health um but if you do it you know just uh not too much there is no reason to be i mean my parents smoked my grandparents smoked uh i i grew up in the pipe smoke myself as a kid and i can understand that this can cause diseases that it's not very good for your health but i try to stay fit i i exercise quite a lot and uh it's my own decision you know i know that it's bad but i still it's not like taking the risk, but I, I, I decide to smoke. Anyway, so because of these new packaging, also they are not selling uh, Orlik Golden Sliced anymore in my in my local store. My local tobacconist said um, I stopped selling. Uh, or like golden sliced, which is really for me is one of the, yeah, it's definitely in the top three tobaccos of all time for me personally. And if he would stop selling it, then we have one slight alternative which we could use instead. It's it's um, the Rainer Flake Blend Seventy One, the the Virginia Flake, which is similar but not the same. I would like to know if some of you guys know if Orlik Golden Sliced will be continued or discontinued. I, I, I'm not sure. I don't want to spread any rumors, but that's what my tobacconist said. He said, no, it's, it's going to be discontinued because of the packaging and uh, they're going to focus on other brands. And I was really, really disappointed because for me, that would mean I would definitely miss Orlik Golden Sliced. I know a lot of you guys out there in the community also really enjoy that tobacco. so. If you have any news, something you know about it, please put put it down in the comment section. I'm going to wrap this video up because I'm already up to 10 minutes. And for me, usually I don't take, uh, I don't make these, these well, long movies. So thanks everybody for your attention. Hope everybody's doing uh, good and see you uh, in the next video. Take care.